Now there's this um, a couple that was up here um, uh, going to the uh, uh, Pensacola school, but uh, you're on your way to the Philippines. What I'm going to do right now is actually a message about this church. It's going to be a prophetic act, and, and, I, and I, I, know, I know in part. And so, uh, uh, Larry and Doris, you got to look in here. Guys, stretch out your hand here to this couple. I will give you many children, many sons, and many daughters. And it was as though there was a spiritual abortion that occurred in years past concerning the Philippines and your life. I was a youth pastor and I was not living holy. And the Bible says without holiness no man will see the Lord. And there was a relational tension that arose. And it was like a spiritual abortion. Something that God did design and God did ordain and God did plant. God pulled out of the womb. But the Lord would say, I am the God of restoration. I am the God that when I declare a purpose, it shall come forth into being. And so I present before you again that you shall yet have many sons and many daughters and many that shall be upon the continents of the earth, that they shall come forth from out of your womb and out of the wombs of those of whom you lift up their hands. And behold, I put in front of you a new beginning of an apostolic mission into the nation of the Philippines for that of which the enemy tried to abort it was never aborted in God's heart behold I put in front of you those whom I will put a spirit of adoption upon it shall be a spirit of adoption from this house to this family and you shall adopt them in the Lord and they will be as though their own enemy meant for evil, God will turn for evil in Jesus' name. This deals with something that isn't just personal with this couple. It's something that, that they're tied in relationally. But this deals with something that goes back to Cleveland, Ohio. This goes back to something even in some of your very beginnings. And the Lord is going back years, and He has kept the record books. He has kept the record books. He has kept the record books. And He knows those promises which have not yet fully been met and fulfilled. And the Lord says, look back at the promises that I spoke to you years ago. Behold, I open a door again in front of you of apostolic missions in Jesus' name. God is looking for some young men, some young Filipino men and women to proclaim his gospel. You say, I don't understand that. Well, they'll pray over it and they will. But we bless this couple. Fire God's on them right now. Uh, it's resting on them right now. Let your fire increase for Jesus Christ's sake for the reward yes. We not only bless them, we send them. We send them. Larry, you gotta come up here right now just for this real quick moment. We not only bless them, we send them. I just want you to just pray that real quick. Eric and Casey, Sierra, we not, and the team, we not only bless you, but we do send you.